Okay, YouTube community, I have a dilemma that I cannot figure out. I am trying to get a static time on this motor, which is a 1600 dual port, I'm sorry, 1641, whatever, dual port. Okay, this, this is how I have things hooked up. And please, somebody tell me if something is wrong. Okay? This is a battery pack. Alright, I've got the negative connected to a jumper cable which goes to the block of the motor okay it's grounded I've got a positive on this side which is going to an alligator clip which is going to the positive side of the terminal you see that positive Go to the positive side of the terminal. On the negative side of the terminal, the negative side of the coil, I'm sorry, goes to the distributor. Points are set enough to where they close. Okay, brand new points. I've got the engine set at seven and a half degrees or whatever before top dead center. I know it's top dead center because when you look at the valves, okay, number three, I'm sorry, number two is moving and not number one. So anyways, I know it's, it's in the correct position, top dead center. Okay, the slit on the distributor is right here where my thumbnail is. As you can see, the rotor points to that slit where my thumbnail is. It's dead on. Okay, so that's there. I've got my test light right here on the negative side of the coil, the same side as the condenser. All right, I put that in here to get a ground. And when I turn on the power for the battery, The light comes on, I go to turn this, and the light does not go off. I cannot get that light to turn off. And as you can see, the points are opening and closing and the light will not turn off. I don't know why the static, I cannot figure out why this will not time statically. If somebody can help me, please tell me what I'm doing wrong. Here are all the connections again, as you can see. Now that battery thing, that all automatically goes out by itself, so that's why that's off. It automatically cuts off. But it's a jumper pack. Okay, that's my connections. This connection runs all the way down here to the positive, which runs to the battery pack positive. Negative runs all the way around to the block of the motor. Okay. Those are my connections. I've checked these connections multiple times. I've changed multiple distributors. I've put multiple condensers on here and multiple sets of points. I even tried an electronic ignition. 
I cannot get Spark. And I don't know why. Somebody please help me. Thank you.